I want to welcome you back to this week's mini clinic on how to cure the yips. The yips is such a scary area that we never want that to happen. Now what causes the yips? One, we talked about the mental aspect where you feel like you should be making these putts or you have to make these putts. We've changed our mindset on putting. We've worked on quieting down the wrist. Now right here, what we want to do to improve or to cure the yips, a major cause of the yips is when someone goes back really short and then tries to accelerate through so they get such a, an acceleration that's sort of a pop or a jab. The other cause of the yips is when you go back too far, then you try to decelerate, and then you have to accelerate to hit this shot or to hit this putt the proper distance. All we're gonna work on here is we're just gonna place two balls or two tees and just place it right there and we're gonna just watch our putting stroke, make sure it goes back the same distance as it goes through. If we can get our stroke to be matching from short distance, same distance back, same distance through. That is a way that you can improve the yips. So what you have to do is identify, are you taking it short back and then accelerating? Are you taking it long back and decelerating, then accelerating? Either way, it doesn't matter. All we wanna do is have the same distance back and through. A great way to practice this is also at home in your kitchen or in your bathroom where you have tile. A tile is gonna be the same distance, whether you have 12 inch tile or whatever the situation is. But if I've got tile here, I'm just going back to the edge of the tile, through to the edge of the tile. Just make your stroke the same distance back and through, and that is a surefire way to cure the yips.